I'm Anne Simmons for the Los Angeles Times. It's no secret that many Africans living in Russia often face hostility. So when I heard about Jean Sagbo, a West African from Benin, who had made history becoming the first black person ever to be elected to political office in Russia, I was anxious to meet him. Four years ago, Sagbo beat five other candidates to become a councilman for the small rural community of Novozavidovsky. That's around 65 miles north of Moscow. He's now into the final months of his five-year term, and I wanted to find out what his experience has been like. So we sat down for a chat over tea and cake in his office inside the town's somewhat run-down administration building. Sagbo told me that when he first arrived in Russia in the early 1980s, people used to stare and point at him, and sometimes they were verbally abusive. Today, he says that's changed. Fair to say the attitude is more positive in Novozavidovsky, Many residents here say Sagbo has proven to be an honest politician and they accept him for who he is. серьёзно изменил отношение людей, ему доверяют больше, чем кому-либо вот живущим в нашем населённом пункте. I wanted to see this for myself, so Sagbo took me on a tour around the community. There were mainly rustic cottages and somewhat shabby apartment buildings. Svetlana Bokova, a local businesswoman, said Sagbo is a trustworthy politician who has helped people get help for alcohol and drug addiction. She ran against Sagbo for the council position, but today she's one of his biggest supporters. She said his race didn't matter in the least. What's important, said this old farmer, Svetlana's father, is that Sagbo is a good man and people can rely on him. Конечно, 